Hi guys and welcome or welcome back to my YouTube channel. My name is Danelia, if you don't already know. If you're not already subscribed to my channel, please subscribe. And yeah, I'm just gonna get straight into the video. By the way, just before I start, sorry. I've just, I'm, I'm new to TikTok. I've jumped on the TikTok by my again. Um, if you'd like to, you know, support, show me love, because it's kind of scary, let me not lie. Um, I've dropped a couple of videos, gonna be content popping up on there. So please go and follow that. Yeah, please. Um, it'll be up here and it will also be in the description box below, like the direct link, so thank you in advance. So in this video, I'm just gonna be talking about my first year experience. I know a lot of people are going to uni soon, literally some people are going in a couple of weeks, others, if you're like my uni, you're not going until October. <laughs> the pain of that when you're fresh up. If you haven't already, I suggest after this video, please 100% watch my freshers guide that I filmed a couple of weeks ago because that literally will just give you so many tips that I think everyone needs to know. Stuff that I wish I knew, stuff that a lot of people wish they knew that will just help you ease into freshers. You know what I mean? So my first day experience, I don't know. Like, I no, I enjoyed first year and I, I did. Maybe right at the end I didn't as much, but i say in order to make the most of your first year, just like explore as much as you can. Like I think a part of what made my first year so great is that I was in a different city literally like every week. Like, it was great. <laughs> making my way to Leicester. It's currently 6.36. I haven't been to bed. This time I'm trekking by myself. But it's okay, actually, I'll just sleep. As long as no one sits next to me. Yeah. I only like it when pe people I know sit next to me, that's fine. But if I don't know really why. <sighs> the other seat's broke, so I can put my bag down and just lay on it. Anyway, bye ya. To Birmingham, got to see my babes on Mira. Who I've got, I've actually got vlog footage of her, which makes me really happy. I got my own, don't need to buy me a drink. Stop asking questions like you care what I think. No! What? No, 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 no! Trying, that just makes perfect. Baby, know that I come first. Jesus Christ, I know, okay, I look horrible. Wait, is it on? Yeah, that's why it's on. <laughs> you know, people like you actually get on my nerves because I don't understand what else would be. Wait. <laughs> oh my god. Okay, so guys, I haven't been vlogging, I haven't even been uploading because I'm just being rubbish. Why are you <laughs> Uh, I look like such a bum. Oh but my god. Quick, quick update. Came to Birmingham in Birmingham right now. Um, watch the last semis. Oh, Jesus Christ, I watched the last semis. Went to what happens in, it was all sharp and it was all good yesterday. Chilled at this girl's um, with her and Theo and it was really chill, it was really good. I didn't vlog anything though. Same with my sister, blah 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 blah. So why are you really don't really care about. You're, you're actually out of breath. <laughs> she lives on the third floor, okay? <laughs> Baby, know that I come first, I come first, I come first Baby, know that I come first, first, first I was just not in the right mindset for a motive And especially, I don't listen to drill and AM and Skengdo came or <laughs> They came, which was lit, of course, especially for the whole crowd, like it was lit, but for me, especially because I don't listen to drill, and I was very waved, <laughs> and I lost my friends. There was a point when I was outside, and because I was waved, I called one of my best friends, and I was crying on the phone to him, and I was like, I don't know where I am. He was like, calm down, call a cab, you know, da -da -da. So yeah, I calmed down, I called a cab, and I went home. I, like, I left the party maybe an hour and a half, two hours early by myself, because I couldn't find any of my friends. Um, I didn't die, so. So long story 
pretty sure we were right by the coach station. We see the coach that we're supposed to get on driving past us, and we were like, L. We didn't get the amendable ticket because you know, you never want to spend that extra pound to get the amendable coach ticket. Always get the amendable coach ticket. I I'm a Okay, so we're in Leicester now. Here's Naomi. Hi. I look like a bum. Dinner with Naomi. What? <laughs> Nibbles with Nay. Ooh, Nibbles saucy. With but um, yeah, in Leicester now, I look like a hot fucking mess because it's, it's natural. Leicester is a city of girls. Yeah, it's been it's been long. It's been a long day of cash loss, extra mileage, my back hurts. I'm not playing that. That's so inappropriate. But um, yeah, I'm talking a lot. I'm just gonna chill for a bit and then I'm gonna get ready and go to freaking waveology. We didn't sleep, we just stayed up, it was great, it was fun. Okay, so I now look like trash. It is the morning ish after Waveology. It was lit. It was the time, I'm trying to find out the time. It's 12.23, so it's not morning anymore, but we barely slept. So in the week, me and one of my teammates went to Naira, DJ Naira to work on our mix, chop it down a bit and perfect it. literally if you have friends in different cities obviously don't just go aimlessly but if you have friends in different cities like link up with them if there are motives in different cities you know link up with your friends and go or just go with your friends from your uni and go explore as much as you can i would say that was one of my best things if you're going to essex um colchester campus because that's the campus that i'm on colchester is quite a village let me not lie i did not know it was a village like that it's literally the oldest recorded town in britain as in there's a whole sign why would you advertise that it's 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 a village let me just tell you that for free so it is worthwhile going to other cities as well obviously like make the most of colchester and if you know people there you like you make friends and stuff so you guys can have your own little adventures like you know what i mean like it's not the worst but it is a village so just warning you in advance um but yeah with my first year experience i would say that is literally what made it the best for me and also trying out new things like i stepped out of my comfort zone and like dancing for example is something that i have always enjoyed doing i've never done it professionally i've never been to a class i've never practiced because i'm not like a dancer dancer i just dance for fun kind of thing so yeah I, I but i have always enjoyed dancing like the way it makes you feel it just makes you feel so happy so free do you know what i mean and the big clash oh what happened there <laughs> the big clash is a game show that i watched from when i was younger like with my sister like since it came out we just watch it all the time on youtube so when i saw that they were doing it while i was at uni and they were coming to my uni i was like you know what, i might as well try kudos to myself that was me stepping up from my comfort zone to the max and i mean stuff like that just step out of your comfort zone do stuff that you find fun you know just try even if you don't get it even if it doesn't work out try step out of your comfort zone and that is how you're going to make the most of your freshers that is well when i say freshers i mean first year and like, that is something i did and that is literally something that i'm still although i find my video very embarrassing because i forgot how to dance and i was just very scared on the day but like i'm still very grateful for the experience some of my closest friends now i met through big clash and that was all how many years ago now i don't even know but it was time ago like maybe two and a half over two and a half almost three years 
I don't know, something like that. And they're still my jeep. Okay, so today I'm going to Coventry for the first clash. This is the start of season seven. I'm so excited. I got my own, don't need to buy me a drink. Stop asking questions like you care what I think. Cause it's clear that you want me, but I come with a warning. So I'ma be real with you, I know what I need. Ain't easy, you gotta earn it. Don't mind just watching you hurt. <laughs> Sin, Sin City was not made for you Angels like you Sin City was not made for you Angels like you Yeah, it was lit. It was actually lit. It was, oh, it was lit. And obviously that was the first class, so that was the opening of season seven. You know that money has been The past I planned on staying in Coventry a bit longer so I could spend more time with my best friends. However, the time is not there, so alas, I must go back to the city of Colchester and you know rehearse. But I'm excited for rehearsals. This will probably go up after my flash. So watch out for Team Essex. We won. I think that was the day we also filmed our MVP. Oh, yeah. So this was our class, this was February 20th, the moment we've been waiting for, the moment we've been rehearsing for, you know, the blood, sweat and tears. Boy, I was excited, I was nervous, but I was excited. Hey, didn't okay. see you there. Smooth skin, skin. Like, we'll hey. Go Say hey. It's just what I wanted to appear. Smooth skin, guys. Yeah. 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 What team has done, you know, that has a key, that is what's key. The hosts will have their answers, they'll coach you for Then you should be ready with the certification and come back on because you will have to be for the team speech. Captain. Hey, overall, like I said, my first year experience was good. It was a good one. The downsides, I would say, were like sometimes I did get really sad and I would just isolate myself. Like it gets like that, do you know what I mean? I thought, I thought at first I would struggle to make friends and sorts of people, but I don't feel like I did. Like I'm not a click image guy, image guy. <laughs> I'm not a clicky like image guy kind of girl. So like there were certain things or like groups of people that like I just didn't really feel like I clicked with because like when you go to uni especially first year loads of people are doing like lifestyle or image that isn't really them I've never been that person like what you see is what you get do you know what I mean so like there were some groups that I didn't really feel like I fit, fit fitted fit fat fit into so like that did kind of put me on edge sometimes but like it wasn't that deep you know what i mean like i found my people at the time and like you know what i mean like it will it will always work out i would say just be true to yourself don't try and enforce a lifestyle don't try and like chill with people that aren't you and the thing is like the people you make friends with in first year may not be your friends forever kind of thing and that is fine i'm just to have fun with it, do you know what I mean? Like, like I said, stay true to yourself. Don't force image gang, don't force any of that. Like, just live your best life that's true to you. I, I think what's so hard about uni, it's not even, like you just come out of doing A-levels, do you know what I mean? 
and I took some difficult A levels so it wasn't like uni work was mad hard it's just balancing the social life and enjoyment with the uni work and like the stress and you know potential anxiety or depression or just loneliness that can make it hard because then you become demotivated but like I said step out of your comfort zone make use of your friends I think social life is very important when it comes to uni like just making sure like you're talking to people you're seeing people you're doing stuff you're going for a walk like there was a point when I was being quite anti let me not lie but I was going for a walk at like 3 a.m or that's when I would do my like weekly shop at Tesco's but then I did have this one friend shout out Femi um well, he wasn't my only friend but I meant like I had this one friend who I would go to Tesco's with sometimes um and it'd be really late but like we'd still go and it just felt nice do you know what I mean like even though it was late I like the fact that I wasn't bumping into loads of people because that's one thing when you're living on campus you're bumping into people non-stop and I hated it and my eyesight is bad so people would think I was ignoring them when I wasn't and it was just it just got a bit annoying just doing small stuff that makes you happy and if that's by crying if that is partying a lot whatever it is as long as you're balancing it with your schoolwork and not doing anything bad to yourself or other people like it's calm do you know what I mean watch my freshest guide video that is the one with like all the info on stuff that will help you get more comfortable meet people all the tips little tips and tricks and hacks and stuff have fun thank you guys for watching all my social media will be in the description box below please follow me on tiktok <laughs> don't forget to like comment and subscribe turn my post notifications on so you don't miss a video and i'll see you guys in my next video bye